Have you ever thought that you wanted to play a Souls Lake or an RPG as a cat? It's not something I've ever thought about, but like now that I know it's a thing, it seems like the best idea ever. Dude, wall jump in a Souls Lake? Heck yeah. <gasps> Look at that, that is so cool. I am so excited for this. Crystalla is a new Souls Like RPG where you get to be a cat. And I did cover this game, that was almost a year ago at this point, uh, when it was in very early stages. Now early access is officially coming out tomorrow, or actually today. <laughs> I think this game is gonna be big, you guys. I just have a feeling it's such a unique idea and a good idea. And that's what we really need in the gaming industry right now is good, unique ideas. And I'll show you what I mean. So the first thing that everyone is gonna be talking about is the fact that you get to be a cat. And <laughs> I cannot believe how cat-like these cats are. Like they just look like house cats. It's adorable. But this is a full out like souls, like this is a serious role-playing game. It's not like a cutesy cat game. I mean, it kind of is, but it's, it's more than that. It's hardcore. So we can have cat boobs or no cat boobs. Well, obviously, I mean, cat boobs, please. Oh, look at this, Tabby, dark gray and white. I gotta look at all these. <gasps> Siamese? Oh, should I be a Siamese? My cat's a Siamese. Maybe I should be Bella. Change my name, that's my cat's name, Bella. I'll just be my cat. I didn't think that they were gonna have like actual real cat races in here. But this is adorable. Like this this game is truly a game for people who love cats and people who love RPGs and Souls like games. Clan. Oh, purple. Oh, wow. Cool. Oh, well, how could I not do that? Purple eyes looks amazing. So there's a class. I think this is the one. Yeah, where you use claws. I'm really interested in that. Head variation looks like we'll be able to change that later. This is still early times. Don't forget that there's gonna be issues and bugs and stuff that we're probably gonna run into. Woo, it's gotta load in here. Um, the graphics right now are on like epic everything. So I might, I might turn it down. I think I had to turn it down last time as well. And there, yeah, <laughs> I think I will. It's definitely performing better, but now I need some vertical sync in my life. Big subtitle size. I'm gonna turn on the big subtitles for you guys. Cause I know some of you have trouble reading the tiny screen. That's better. My character looks so different from before. So we've got this thing, which is sort of like our, um, it's like our bonfire. So if you think of this game as a souls, like it sort of behaves that way uh, in its base mechanics. But another thing that I'm pretty certain about is at least the early access of this is gonna be releasing in chapters. So right now, like chapter one of the game is kind of released. Although they did say that since it is like the main world of the full game, there's like, it's not 100% complete even. It's just, we have access to um, a few hours of gameplay. We've got light attack and heavy attack. Press R to lock on. Okay. Okay, here we go. They're little like zombie mice dudes. Huh? And I already kind of just like, I feel like I already know the controls because of I've played Souls games before. When I played this in the very early builds, it was pretty easy. So I'm wondering if the difficulty is ramped up at this point. Use mana to cast spells. Cast L T plus X to cast your equipped spell. Okay. Oh, I don't have I don't have it though, do I? I don't have a spell. <laughs> Seems like locking on is gonna be pretty important in this game. Just judging by how the movement feels. Dash, double tap, B to dodge, you're briefly invulnerable. Okay. And then it looks like when I hit them, I, I stagger them as well. So open the inventory to use consumables. Okay. Dregs of crystal dust. Here's my inventory. 
Bone steel claws, a pair of lobster plated claws, fit for carrying out quick successive strikes. All right, so that's what we're gonna be doing. This is our healing, like our Estes flask, I'm pretty sure. So I'm gonna try not to use that up. Consume a charge of your stigma rubinus to recover health. Cons consume a charge uh, to, of your stigma ameth amethystos to recover mana. Okay. So we got down for health, left for mana. Okay. Let's see if I can remember that. Sprints. Sprint towards obstacles to automatically vault over them. Okay. Dregs. Where can we go? I'm a cat. Everybody wants to be a cat. Because the cat's the only cat. Knows where it's at. I don't actually know if that's how it goes. Yeah! Been a while since I saw that one. But we can climb around as if we were a cat in this game, which is one of the things I was really excited to show you guys. <laughs> and I can't wait to see like how everything plays out when the game is 100% finished because I feel like it's going to be so amazing. Have you ever thought that you wanted to play a Souls Lake or an RPG as a cat? It's not something I've ever thought about, but like now that I know it's a thing, it seems like the best idea ever because cats are just so dexterous, you know, and they've got deadly claws. Wow. I picked up crystals and they have nine lives. I wonder if they implemented that into the game at all. Why don't we have nine charges on our <laughs> on our Rustus Flask? You take an amount of non-lethal damage when you fall in deep water and respawn nearby. Oh, okay. Cats hate water, so I guess that's the excuse for that. Whoa. Walk or jump to a rope top and automatically get onto it. Okay, here we go. Yep. Ooh, where we go? Holy crap. Jump off a rope. Drop directly below it. Oh, okay. Thank you for doing that for me, game. <laughs> so that's one of our very kitty cat-like things. Pick up, uh, light up dark areas with your light shroom. I don't think I have that. I feel like I don't have any of this stuff that it's telling me to do. Am I wrong? Corruption can be lethal if you get too close. You can clear it by destroying its source. Is this the source? Yes, it was. Okay. Jump to the rope. Ooh. Oh, oh, oops. Um. <laughs> there we go. I feel like Lara Croft doing that. Jump and bounce off the wall on your side by hitting jump again. Oh, <laughs> wall jump, baby. Oh, yes, wall jump. Dude, wall jump in a soul's lake? Heck yeah. <laughs> Look at that, that is so cool. That was definitely not in the early build. <laughs> okay, momentum and proper timing can help you reach even further. Sprint and perform the wall jump. Ooh. What about this though? Ah! Ow. Okay, I can't attack that, I guess. At least not right now. Okay, sprint. Ah! Ooh, okay, that was not good timing. Let's do that again. Oops, that was bad as well. So, in case anyone's wondering, um, the required method is to use a controller for this game, but you can play with keyboard and mouse. Oh God, I'm just really bad with controllers. I'm using a controller right now, but I feel like I'm a pretty poor example of like how to play this game at the control <laughs> or any game for that matter. Okay. I think I need to be closer. But this is definitely teaching me how to do it. Okay, let's do like sprint. Oh, got it. Okay, perfect. No, let's not fall back down. It does have a um, like attack for when you jump down onto people as well. Okay, and I know we can get up 
Okay, I actually meant to climb on top of that, but that's okay. This music is giving me like some kind of vibe. I'm not sure what it is, but I love it. Ooh. Go to the equipment tab to equip your new weapon set. Cycle between your equipped weapons by holding. Oh, did I get a new weapon set? Did I? Weapons. Oh, yeah. Heartwood, sword, and shield. A classic duo forged in Jakandan Heartwood. Best suited for parrying and close combat quarters. So, it's more damage than what I am currently using. So I guess I'll try it out, right? Hold block and to reduce incoming damage. Whoa, that was weird. Okay. Oh, he's squeaking. I remember this. I remember you and I remember this. I blew, yeah, and there's a, there's like a perfect block sort of situation that you can do, I think. Okay, so check this out, everybody. Ha, I'm on top of the lantern post. Nobody could do that except a cat. Go to the equipment tab, change your armor. Okay. Am I just going to turn into a warrior anyways? Uh, where's my... I didn't get armor. Oh, yes I did. Okay. Angler breaches. Or angler breaches. I put some angler breaches on. But are those better than mine? The item details. Oh, here we go. Okay. Um, no, mine are better, so why would I wear those? I don't know. Yeah. Let's continue. Attack and deflect enemies uh, lowers their balance bar once it's empty. Press RT to perform a takedown. Oh, okay. That, that's what the yellow bar is. And then tick down. Oh, that was awesome, dude. That was cool. <laughs> oh, I love it. Combat feels really nice. Dude, and this isn't even the full game. I'm really liking this so far. I just, I like, I, I really just want to open it up and have it let me be out of the tutorial so I can just like go <laughs> do my thing. Bog grog. That sounds yummy. What about destroying environmental stuff? We definitely need the ability to destroy barrels and stuff if that's not already a thing. So what are we getting here? Uh, forgotten fervor. We got these dregs, which are like the little, you know, the soul things where you can kind of like Dark Souls, where you can use them and get a bunch of dust or whatever. Bog grog, cures poison, cures poison. Okay. Okay. So. Oh, I guess I do. Oh, okay. Ooh. Oh, he's got like a flurry the situation. I think that round attack, that spin attack, you can attack more than one dude at a time. Dodgy McDodgerton, that's me. Actually, my name's Bella. Bella Kitty. Yeah. Use it twice in a row to perform a combo. Okay, I should have done that. I was worried about getting hit though. In fact, let's heal. Why not? Just in case, you never know. Hold B to crouch and move silently. Backstab enemies, yes! By pressing RT on your back. Crouch. Oh, look at me go! I'm crawling. I'm like walking like a kitty, kind of, sort of. <laughs> like a bipedal kitty. Yeah, there we go. Okay, sorry. Fumbled a bit there. Can we also hide in the grass? I bet we can. <gasps> I mean, come on, guys. Is this not the greatest idea for an RPG to let you be a cat? 
I'm so excited. Next, we need a dog RPG. I'm <laughs> so excited. <sighs> By the way, I don't know if I mentioned this already, but just in case I didn't, it's a female-led development team, which is also really awesome, and that's kind of what got this game on my radar initially. I have to check again. I want to say it's maybe 20-ish people making the game, and it's a very diverse team of devs, but uh, it's it's led by some ladies, which is so cool. I'm a huge fan, obviously, as a lady myself. <laughs> but I would love to see more serious RPGs or Souls-like games. I love them. Uh, I would love to see more uh, female-led teams make more of these types of games. I'm wondering if, like, the silence of my character right now is on purpose because you know I'm a cat and I'm very silent. But I feel like there should be some noise, like a, like the very slightest of clo cloth rustling or something. I don't know. But I I'm kind of digging the crawling animation. <laughs> okay, let's go climb around and be a kitty cat. Uh, okay, Oops. that was my mistake. Okay, stay on the roof this time, please. Thank you. Now there's got to be something cool up here we can get right. I think with the jumping mechanics and stuff, they could add so many really cool hidden things around the world. The full release as well. That would be awesome. Give me all the like secret kitty Easter eggs to find. Uh oh, oh, I forgot the range guys are literally the worst. Can they shoot his friend? I don't know. Oh, wrong button. Oh, why isn't that working? Why isn't my shield working? There we go. That was weird. I, I think that was probably me. I'm not really sure what I did something wrong there. Okay. But yeah, I would love to be able to just like break barrels, kind of like in Dark Souls. To me, that feels like a thing we need to be able to do. <laughs> Very minor, not important thing, but still feels good when you get to do it. You can climb on walls with a specific type of vine. Jump towards them to initiate the climb. Freely traverse the area. The vines cover. Press B to drop from the wall. You will automatically climb when you reach the top of the wall. Okay. Heck yeah. Cats are epic climbers. Jump over unaware enemies and press RT to perform an aerial takedown. Yeah, dude, awesome. The gate to the caves requires a special key. The general has already found it and is waiting for us in the fort. Reports say there are documents of value in the mansion. Okay. So now that we got that, does that mean that we can just really go about our business. What about a map? Have we got one of those? Is that a thing? I mean, it's a Souls Lake, so probably not. Use Chris to level up at the Illyrian fonts. Resting at a font fills your stig stigmata charges, but also responds most killed enemies, just like a Souls Lake would. But I'm really interested in the difficulty levels because Souls games are usually pretty tough and they tend to repel certain types of gamers because of the difficulty level and like people don't like, you know, uh, some people don't like the I have to die and run back and learn my lesson and keep trying and trying and trying sort of a thing. Um, but when I played the original version, it was a little easier and I, I really thought it seemed more like beginner souls like kind of and that would be really cool also to have some of those games sitting out, out ar around you know in the Ooh, i don't know what i want <laughs> balance and equip load uh you know if if there was if it was a little bit easier i think that would be a good thing because it could attract some new types of gamers to play um this sort of game get into the souls like genre a little bit the Lost Charts. Stranger, I request that you acquire for me five particular scrolls. Star charts to be exact. Long age loan. Long ago, loan to the something. Okay. 
<laughs> I'm sure we can read that in our inventory if we really want. So we're gonna need to destroy this in order to get into there. Can I do that now? Can I climb up on this stuff? I can go up here. But I, I don't think I can get over there yet. So let's go this other way. Oh yeah, this is where we get to be a kitty cat for reals. I love this part. I love this. don't see me yet anyways oh there he is I meant to press I, I pressed my bad I have borked it Oh, I switched, I switched my weapons. Accidentally? That's okay. I like the claws anyway. I think I'll just stick with them. There's, some, there's stuff in these houses too, so I probably don't want to skip them. Let's go into here. This is starting to look very familiar though. I wonder if this is the exact same area that I played before in the in the early build. I think it is. Because the cat's the only cat who knows where it's at. I wish I, I... I should look up that song. I can't remember any other lyrics. <laughs> I'm gonna annoy you all. Just singing that one verse over and over. Whoa! Okay, I didn't know I was gonna do that or I would have tried harder. I wanted to go up on top of it. That's okay. Oh, what do we got? Bog Grog. Ooh. Being knee deep in water prevents you from crouching, dashing, and jogging. Okay. Uh, I'm excited to fight the boss. I remember the boss. I wonder if they added more bosses. That would be sick. Uh, no! Oh god. Okay. <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. Okay. More bog grog. Is this the fort? Hello. <clears throat> Let's be sneaky. Got a purple thing here. Ring a roots gambeson. What is that? Is that an item to wear? It is. Gamison worn by the Ring of Roots. Okay, so it's different from mine. Um, lightning and nature resist instead of mine. I, I like mine though. We're just getting the whole set of that gear. So maybe if you pick the other one to start, you get this one? No, there was more than two. I don't know. Whoa! Oh, you found me! Oh. Two perfect blocks needed for those guys. I gotta remember to do the combos as well. Okay, scrolls. We've got... Oh, so we're in the mansion right now. We have two out of five scrolls. Okay. This is not the fort. It's the mansion. Oh, a little baby's room. And a target dummy in the baby's room. 
Let's be a hardcore baby. Okay, um, clearly I missed some things downstairs. How about this? Ah, here we go. Oh, there we go. There's some money. Ooh. Alright. Here we go. Another scroll. It's interesting because it feels like the gameplay loop is very much like RPG. Or, well, the gameplay mechanics are Souls-like. But then the fact that we're just going around doing some little quests and stuff is feels very RPG. And I, I love both those things. So I'm really excited to see where this goes. Oh. <laughs> that was a door. Cool, now I can get back up whenever I want. Okay, there's one more somewhere. So there must be a lower floor where I'm... Oh, hello. Ow. We're gonna heal. Because that was a little risky. Bog grog. Bring our roots. Challs. Okay, then this must be the scroll? Nope, that's the hat. Okay. Well, there must be another scroll around here somewhere. Whoa. Okay. Ow, I'm failing really badly. Okay, unlock, okay, unlock, 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 unlock! Holy crap. Alright, that was just me panicking and performing really poorly. <laughs> It definitely gets a little tricky when there's more than one guy, that's for sure. Five hundies. And... Yay! Okay, we got all of those. But who do I bring that to? Well, I guess I'm just done with that then. I need to go to the fort in order to, like, actually continue. This might be just a side thing that we can do or something. Whoa! Whoa! <gasps> Okay. okay. Uh oh. Uh oh. I'm stuck. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. I might have found a bug. Uh oh. <laughs> oh god, I can't get out of here. Um, maybe if I do. I'm <laughs> trying to do my special abilities. Oh, I almost got out. I almost got out. Oh, it teleported me into the middle of them. But that's okay. I was done there anyways. Although, now I need to go back and get my stuff, don't I? Oh, gosh. Darn it. I want to kill all these guys again, but... I... I gotta get my my souls back, you know what I mean? No! Yeah. Okay. Oh, there's more loot there? Okay, why didn't that max set? Did I not get this before? Wagon stripe. Okay. Oh, oh, what? What? <laughs> okay, I don't know what's going on. It's all fine, everybody. It's all fine. Here it is. Okay. It's stealth. Now, where's my stuff? There. Ah! Jesus. 
Jeepers creepers. Kill you first. Holy buckets of beans. Okay, got him. I would like to say, just as a report, just reporting in, this definitely feels a lot more Souls-like than it did before. It, it like, the mechanics were Souls-like early on, but the difficulty really wasn't there, and now, uh, now it, it does remind me of, like, maybe a little, oh my god, maybe a little bit more of a casual experience with the Souls-like, but it's still, it's still quite, quite hard, I think, or, you know. Challenging. Oh, I'm dying. Let's go in. Let's go in here again. Can I? Excuse me. I want to go back in. I want to go back in. Why am I not healing? Okay. What happened there? I don't know. <laughs> oh. I can hit them. Yeah. Okay, I can cheese them all. Good. Yes, I will be doing that. Thank you very much. I will be cheesing my way to victory. Thank you so much. Okay. I got my cool crystal self back, which gives me. My one shard that I had, I guess? I'm, I'm not really exactly sure what I got back. I think I had one full shard. Okay, let's go across here. Because we didn't get to explore. Crystal dust. We've got this lovely kitty cat statue here, which looks... Oh, it's broken. Well, the other side of it looks nice. Okay. A glitchy fish guy over there. You can't reach me because you're glitchy. I thought I wasn't allowed to jump, but I guess I yeah. am. Okay. <clears throat> uh, well, I suppose I can leave then. Oh! Let's do the spin attack. Oh no! <laughs> God, he died again! Oh no! I didn't realize my health was so low. Oops. Remember to lock onto your enemies. Yeah, that does seem very important in this game. It definitely does. Oh, fudge! I should probably, um,. Use this stuff. <laughs> Physical prowess and your HP. Physical power, ability to cast spells, strength, heavy weapons, finesse, finesse based weapons. What's malediction? Magic. Magic defenses and resistances, though. That's good. I'm gonna just get health. You can never go wrong with that. I'm on the wrong side. Oh, 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 oh! Wrong! Wrong! Mistakes were made. Kind of regret not doing the magic class, honestly. Oh, oh god. Okay. Oops, I interrupted my heal. That was silly, wasn't it? Lock on. Lock on. Too early. Okay. Oh. Yeah, having some range damage would be really quite nice. Would be really quite nice, don't you know? 
Whoa, look at this. Maybe I should forsake my... Um, things that I lost. No, I shouldn't. I should play the game correctly. Kill the stupid slug thing. Oh god, don't die. Oh, heal. Okay, alright, okay. on the other guy I think <laughs> not the fish guy I know that was confusing so never mind you know what I will do though let's use all of our items that we have to increase okay let's get that then we'll go to the spell tree we'll just learn drain life because that's clearly what the game wants me to do okay here we go okay I should also be looking for ways to go up. We are a cat after all. Hello. Like so. Now we are up. What is this? Is it anything? I don't know. I'm so sneaky, no one can see me. There's some loot right in the middle of that thing. How do I get rid of the goop? Let's go up on this side. Oh. Can I get through there? Oh. Yeah. Okay, this is the... Available in the full game, ho oh, ho! Pretty soon! I believe the roadmap said that the next update would be... Did it say, it was, I think it was September. Oh. Oh, I remember you guys. These dudes are rough. Combos are how you deal with them, all right. I believe the fort is this way, if I do remember correctly. I wonder if I could jump on that guy. Or sneak up on him. That would be ideal. Oh, come on! That was so lame. It's okay, we got him. We got him. He like, he flipped around the second I tried to backstab. Baloney. That's what I say. All right, now we're gonna infiltrate this fort and it's gonna be amaze balls. Watch this. I can't see what I'm doing though. Okay. Whoa. Yes, yes, okay. Tiger's eye. Ooh, what's that? What's that? Um, tiger's eye. 
I don't know. Am I crazy or? I don't see it anywhere. Okay. There's a mouse eating there. Oh, somebody saw me, but I'm the essence of stealth itself. I'm a cat. Some dumb guy on the top there. Well, at least he didn't alert this guy. Let's just remain stealthy. Remain the essence of stealth as long as we can. No, it's you. He saw me through the wood, I guess. It's fine, whatever. This bit was really rough the first time. I don't think we had the stealth ability and they did not have that little opening um, to get in. You had to go like right through the front door, so it's much nicer. Oh, hi. Whoa, what are you doing? Am I allowed to cheese the heck out of you? Oh, you got in, okay. I need to heal. Ah! 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 Go! Oh my god, I just spammed. I just freaking spammed. And I'm gonna die. Oh no. Um, I do have a healing item. I better use it, I guess. Okay, that wasn't that much. It's fine, though. Get through the bleeding. Ah, that was a bit panicky, but you know. Can I? I wonder if I can do that without going into my inventory. I don't know. Okay, that maybe that was the only big guy we need to worry about. Hopefully. Oh, I pressed the wrong button. Mighty Mesozot. Look. <gasps> That's a gun. That's a gun right there. Interesting. I know a gun when I see one. Okay, what did I just loot? I don't know. <laughs> Maybe it was, oh, this, okay. Use that as smithy to upgrade common weaponry. Oh, I bet that other thing is in here somewhere too. Here we go. Okay, we got this. Tail like in the mince face. Uh, okay, I don't know what that is. And then tiger's eye is petrified eye. I don't know. Maybe we can also make something with that. Let's keep looting the place. Yellow marks. Yellow marked can't be blocked. Red marked can't be blocked or defected. Oh, right. I forgot about deflecting. What did I just get? Oh, because these guys have guns, of course, yeah. That's why there's a gun there. But I don't know if we're going to be able to get guns. No idea. Fledgling alms. What is that? That looks like this thing. Uh, a foul bounty given in gift unto the sacred six of want of renewal. Offer in exchange for safe passage to the font last honored. It's a homeward bone cat version. <laughs> All right, now we need to go up. Whoa! Holy buckets of beans. Okay. 
Things are getting a bit risky around here. I don't like it. No. Just go up. Surely you can make it up there like that, cat lady. I forgot I could drain life, too. That's nice. Doing that before. Okay. Bog grog. Boggity groggity. You gonna see me? I'm going. If I go here, he didn't see me. He's none the wiser. Oh what? That was definitely a sneak attack. Okay. So is the key gonna be all the way over here? Nope. Those are some. Clothes. This is definitely the fort, right? Did I already get it? Oh, I already got it and I didn't even realize. Oh. Alright, well, never mind then. I'm gonna leave that one guy al alive. Okay, open the gate at the end of the village. Alright, I guess we did it! I do remember that the gate is it's back by the spawn, isn't it? Or is it this? Oh, hello, sneaky dude. I'm definitely gonna go across here and get you. I don't have a lot of health, though. Oh, I can't. That guy's too sneaky for his own good. Hmm. I don't think they can get me on the rooftops. They're trying. <laughs> I could teleport back, but then everybody would respawn, which would be a little annoying. I <sighs> can't get through there. important to make those time blocks. Very, very important. I'm gonna use another healing item as well. Oh, you big jerkwad. <gasps> okay. And I wanted to get those guys out of the way because when we go back here, we're gonna get ambushed by a stupid dude. I would like to- Whoa! Okay. I didn't think I was gonna get ambushed by two stupid dudes, but here we are. Okay, there's a guy right here that wants to kill me. He really does. Maybe I could cheese him? But maybe if I go across here after I've aggroed him, maybe he'll follow me. Yes. Oh, they put that grass there so I could sneak attack him. Oh. That's why. Okay. I'm going to jump down on him in a second once he goes back. Why did that work? Got 
gotcha. Gotcha. Okay. Is it this gate? No. <laughs> it's not. Oh. Let's get a high ground look. We did the fort. That gate was closed, so it must be something over here. I think I got stuck on this the first time as well. Is it that gate? Maybe it's that gate. Did I try that gate? Oh. I think I did, actually. Yeah. What? Maybe I can get up. Can I get onto that light pole somehow? Ha. Yes. Oh. Oh, I got in. <gasps> Was I supposed to do that? I... I am honestly not- Ah! <laughs> I'm honestly not sure. Because <laughs> it didn't really seem- It said open the gate, so I'm not really sure if that's what I was meant to do. Oh, there's a thing to go right there. Uh huh. Chest deep in water prevents you from jumping. Okay. Chest deep prevents you from jumping. I see. Alright, well, we got somewhere new. I guess that's something. Dust. Whoop. Okay, there's something over there. Won't fall in. Platforming time. I'm going this way first. Just because it looks like there's something inter like loot in here. And I like loot. I like me some loot. Angler cap. Let's check out that angler gear. <sighs> okay. Um. I don't have the chest piece yet. Lightning resist. So far the armor that I have seems to be the best for this situation. Or maybe that's just me, I don't know. Okay. Ah! Crap! I jumped. I jumped! Now I have to heal though, which is a little annoying. Oh, I'm back in here. Okay. All right, let's not fail at the platforming this time. There we go. Okay. Where'd that guy go? Wasn't there a fish guy right here? I swear there was. Okay. Ah. Oh, just barely got it. Okay. Oh. Oh, this is over the fort. A little secret way in. Okay. Ah. Okay, but we don't need to go that way. I don't even know if I'm going the right way. <laughs> no clue. Is this the gate that I need to open? There we go. Okay. Wow. That was actually kind of hard to get to. Nice. I had to actually figure something out. Ooh, yay. We get bonfire, so to speak. 
Beautiful. Okay, progress. Progress! Alright, let's do... That also boosts up my health. I think I'm just gonna keep doing that. <laughs> we didn't get another crisp pearl. What's this? That's beautiful. Big crystal. Okay. We can't climb up that at the moment because there's goop on it. Corruption. But now if we die, we just go back there, which is nice. Not very far back at all. Okay. So it's kind of like Dark Souls where if you stay in the poison long enough, you end up getting the debuff, I think. What? Oh god. Okay. Back up. That's the wrong way. <laughs> Ow. Yeah, we're fine. We're fine. Ish. Lion's mane. That's a shroom. It's in here. Oh. The corruption. This is like a little camp or something. Can I jump over this? Ah! No, no I can't. Big no. Don't try to do that. <laughs> that is a definite kill wall. But I had my respawn fairly close, so I thought I would take a risk. Risk it for the biscuit, so they say. Unfortunately, now we have to kill these dudes again. a lot of ways to... Nope, that's the wrong way! I'm poisoned! It's fine. I was gonna say, I do have a lot of ways to actually clear poison, so... Oh! I'm dead. Wow. Oops. Okay, poison actually kills you very quickly. <laughs> Oops. We're supposed to be patient and probably defeat the, the thing there first uh, to get rid of the corruption. But we could probably skip through this part. I have that. Can you guys climb up here? And you can I guess you can only do the the cool jump moves if they don't see you first, which makes sense, right? Yeah, that makes sense. Okay, so is there no, there's nothing to do. Somebody died? <laughs> okay, there's a purple thing there. How the heck do you get that? I don't know. I guess we go down. Going up is not what we... Going up is, like, for later. 
Hello. What's in here? Oh, no, here we go. Okay, all right, okay. Oh, now I bet I could go back and get that. Yeah, but then it will just, it just makes me go into here anyway, okay. We're going on the right track. Oh! Oops. <laughs> there we go, thank you. Make sure we don't get surrounded. Woo! These guys are pretty creepy, I gotta say. Uh. Oh! Ow! That hoits. That does hoits. Okay, this area is definitely a bit tougher, I would say. I've got those fish guys who are a little bit stronger. But I am I am going to continue my speed run. <laughs> does the red stuff stay gone? Oh it does. Okay, so this is a shortcut. Like it. I like it. It also allows me to go up here and get this. No! Oh, well, that's lame. Just decide. Sometimes it doesn't let me grab the things. Seems a little unreliable. I feel like I'm a cat and I should be able to grab all the things whenever I need. Anyways, I'm back here again. I could go this way. What about my, about my dead self? My dead self. Come here, dead self. Okay, I'll kill you guys. Okay. Let's try going this way. Oh, got it. Oh, just barely. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna just kind of go fast here. Crystal dust, crystal dust. Sprint, sprint, sprint. <gasps> Got it. I love that. That is so fun. All right, mister. Do I actually have to kill you? No. I don't think that I do. <laughs> <laughs> Loser. Loser. Dude, that's awesome that you can skip people like that. And it feels really nice to just like flip around the landscape and act like a total cat badass. I'm loving it. Okay, here we are. I think we're getting close to where I got to initially in the in the early build. And I'm just gonna play for as long as I can here. Whoa! Oh god. Okay, what did we get rid of? What is all this? Nikes. Um, oh, does this link up where we were? No. Yes? No, yes, no, yes. I don't know. Where am I? <laughs> I don't know where I am. Is this new? I think this is new. Purple thing up there. Hmm. We're still trying to get the treehouse. That was the objective initially as well. But I'm hoping since this is a uh, more complete, you know, version of the game that I'll be able to go beyond the treehouse. I do remember there's a boss coming up. Oh, there's the crystal. Oh, we got rid of that, so now, okay. 
It's the same crystal though, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. Sneaky level design there, but I like it. Itchy eyeballs. Sneaky, itchy eyeballs. Okay, what do we want for the boss? Um, honestly, I just kind of want more health. <laughs> I can't get more health. Okay, fine. Be that way. Fine, be that way, game. Here's the purple thing. Okay, let's get the purple thing. I think I might need to go to that landmass, but I kind of want to explore as well. There's stuff up there. Is this where I've already been? Because it does seem to connect up pretty nicely, doesn't it? Yes. Okay, that's where that jerk is. So I don't need to go that way. I need to go down. All right. Are we allowed to jump down here? Probably not. <laughs> Probably would kill me, wouldn't it? Yep, boss. Okay. Hello! Slofy. Okay, is he gonna do the same thing? Oh! Yeah, looks like it. So it took me a few tries last time to, to defeat this guy. I wonder if it's gonna be oh, more difficult this time. He dodged through that, luckily. Ow, ow, ow. Huh? Huh? Ow. Okay, it's definitely not easy. I need you to come back over here, sir. Okay, I can dodge through it. Is he just gonna stay there forever? Since I'm not chasing him? Oh, I can't. I don't have my sword and shield. Oops. No wonder I wasn't blocking properly. Oh, that's kind of cool. I didn't try that before. Little claw attack. <laughs> Does I wonder if the boss has um, the meter. Okay. Ow, that hurt. <laughs> Why am I not healing? Thank you. Ow! Maybe I do need to get his green bar to go down. Maybe that's what the whole deal is. But how would I... Oh, frick. How would I attack him enough to make that a reality? Ow. 
Okay, maybe I should try my sword and All right, let's do this. Ow, bad start. I definitely hit dodge. I don't, oh, that's because it, <laughs> I accidentally crouched instead, okay. All right, we're gonna block him. And we're gonna go. Okay. Heal. Close in. Sneaky, sneaky. Okay, we'll use one of these to get our mana back. And then we'll just wail away. Dodge. Huh? Yeah, one. No! Okay. Oh, no! What happened there? What? Oh, I pressed the wrong button. Frick. Using all my juice. No! Fudge. Oh, man. I feel like this guy's definitely tougher than he was the first time. I think I killed him in like a few tries in the early uh, build. So he's, he's definitely beefed up his brain since then. It has so much potential to be super, super fun and memorable for everybody. It's so unique. And as the game gets more fleshed out and smoother and everything else, I think it's going to be just a joy to play. It's already so much better than it was originally when I played it almost a year ago. Um, and it was even fun then too. It's just like, you can tell that they put a ton more work into the game at this point. And I'm really excited to see the progress that they're going to keep making <laughs> and the more kitty cats that we can be. Thank you to Astro Clockwork Studios for giving me a game key for this build to check out. And I wish you guys the best of luck with your development process. I'm behind you 100%. For more games like this, check out all my Dark Souls Let's Plays. I played so much of those games. Love them to death. Until next time, everybody, stay cheesy.